Deb here, Rebecca, just now Becky. So keeping the dogs out of this one today because I think it would just be a little odd. So I wanted to do a video showing like plants that look like their owners, but I realized that I really wanted to show off my booby cactus and once I got it out, I realized that's not gonna work because my booby cactus is more perky than I am. So that wasn't gonna work. So then I thought about it some more and I thought, how about all of my plants that are just not safe for work? So we're doing my not safe for work plant collection. So if you're easily offended, you don't want to watch, but you might never look at your plants the same way again. Sorry, like I said, plant entertainment. Plant entertainment, not plant education. Although this is possibly an education. And don't worry, no plants are ever harmed in the making of my videos. And I thought about wearing maybe my leather mask with the zipper, but then there were audio issues, so I had to take it off. I don't have one of those masks. Or do I? You'll never know. Maybe you do know. You don't know. I don't. And I've never tried any of this out. Or have I? I haven't, I promise. I'm a 46 year old woman. The cobwebs, they just need to stay where they're replaced. It's been a really long time. Dust <coughs> would, oh. <coughs> Poppy. <coughs> I guess the dogs aren't staying out of this. The dust, if anything <coughs> happened, would go, <coughs> there would be a cloud. I think an Amazon package arrived. What could it be? All right, so let's start with the first one that I wanted to show off, my booby cactus. We'll start safe and move on from there. This is the one that I couldn't start with what I wanted to do, and it turned into this, the not safe for work collection. So, my booby cactus. See? They're still a little pokey on the nipples. It's one of my favorites in my collection. All right, short and sweet, the booby cactus. From there, where do we have to go? Ready? The penis cactus. <laughs> That's right. I love my penis cactus. Don't worry. It just hangs in my window. It hasn't grown. Maybe I haven't tried hard enough. Okay. Now. For the good stuff. If you have a child in the room Move along. Did you see my necklace? Let's just start with that plant. I'll give you scientific names and common names if I know the scientific name. This one is Senecio, or is it Sene Yeah, Senecio Timeupus also known as the string of bondage. See, lots you can do with this plant. It's a very strong string of plants. Now, you have to remember, these aren't made of leather, so they're not terribly strong, but if you braid them together, Fairly good. 
senecio timeopus, string of bondage. <clears throat> Along the same lines, we're going to move on to whipsalis hearts, commonly known as the string of mini paddles. This, oh, shaky. Okay, this one, it looks sweet, but trust me, it's not. Those can do some damage. All right, string of mini paddles. Whipsalis hearts. Getting a little feisty on this next one. Are you ready? It's a succulent. Ribural oh. Ribiranus succulent. Ribiranus succulent. Just leaving it there. What's next? Okay, this next one, I don't know like the super scientific name, but we're just gonna go with old white men still pack a punch cactus. Now, before I show you, we're just gonna let you know, because of the color being white and the fact that it's fuzzy, and it looks kind of soft and old. You wouldn't think that it could do so much damage and pack a punch, but it does. So white, fuzzy, you'd kind of maybe think that it's diminutive, maybe a little not so firm and dangerous. Old white men still pack a punch cactus. Ouch. What's next? How about Sirius warmupus, also known as training finger cactus? This is a cactus it grows so fast, it's prolific. So things can always be changing up. Keep things interesting. Should probably use this one before the old man, the old white men can pack a punch cactus. It also offers, you know, lots of options in one pot. And like I said, it's always changing. Also, texturized. The double. You know what that's good for. And two more in my collection. We'll go with The caning cactus. <laughs> this one can be fun. <laughs> Ouch. Now, it's pretty stiff and fairly strong. And it's a little rubbery, which sometimes works to your benefit. The caning cactus. Last one, just one more. Oh, oh, this is the Paddle Your Ass Sensoveria. Ouch, firm, sharp edge, wide. Paddle Your Ass Sensoveria.
All right. Well, I hope you enjoyed seeing my not so not safe for work collection of plants. I hope you're not easily offended. Probably if you made it to the end, you're not. Probably if you unsubscribed by now, you are. And that's okay, because this is the type of content you may occasionally see. The next thing you may see will probably be safer. So you can invite your children back into the room and I'm not gonna go get Elbert to say goodbye and I'm not gonna go get Poppy to say goodbye, but Poppy's barking and I think he even hopped back up here so you did get to see him. Elbert's over there going crazy that he can't get to me. So we'll just do a Poppy, whoa, and an Elbert. There, that was Elbert. And I hope that you enjoyed and you now look at your plants entirely differently thanks to me. So I hope you have a fantastic day and we'll see you next time. And if you feel like being plantertained, subscribe. I'm up to 50. How about that?